WFN Headline News Update. Okay, folks, Larry Pesavento for TFNN. Uh, today I'm going to give you an update. Uh, let's talk about the money markets a little bit, especially the euro. Uh, the euro is the opposite, of course, of the U.S. dollar. With euro going up, U.S. dollar going down. Well, that's changed today, folks. As you'll notice here that we had a big move here in the euro early this morning when the report came out. It was rallying eight days into a perfect 382 number. Uh, that was one of the trades we did in our trading. Well, actually, we were a little bit late because uh, from now on, our trading day is going to start going from 8 until 11 because we have to be there during the reports because the reports would have given you an extra twelve, thirteen hundred dollars in profits. We did well. We had one loser. It was a Japanese yen trade. We lost uh, just three pips in that. I thought it was the best trade of the day because I realized it was an error right from the beginning. And so we just got out of it, and of course it reversed and kept going down, 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 which was smart because we only lost uh, $18. But we did okay, which was good. We're going to be uh, coming into an up week after being down last week. Uh, we're going to have some really interesting things going on this coming week, folks. So make sure you have your trading shoes on because there's going to be some wild volatility next week. Something like we haven't seen in quite some time. That's my opinion, of course. And if opinions are like armpits, everybody has one, and it usually smells a little fishy. Anyway, those are the main things. Also, we had some moves here, uh, bearish moves, I think, in silver uh, and gold. They should have rallied a lot more given the, the advance that was there with uh, all the stuff that was going on. But uh, it didn't work out the way that we thought, so... We still made good money in the trade, but uh, not as much as we had hoped. But the crude oil was good. The Dow Jonesy Mini was good. Uh, the uh, There was a fourth one in there. I can't remember. We netted over over $1,000 on the trades, which uh, for the month, that means we made over 2800 on the first week and then fifth, around 1000 today. So had a lot of fun. The three hours goes back like lightning. So hope you can join us on May 10th if you get a chance. So. That'll be a lot of fun. So we're going to have a guest next week, but we'll be right back after we pay a few words. of trade.